Hello friends and subscribers, welcome back to Daniel's Tech World here on YouTube. My name is Daniel Rosal, this channel is dedicated to talking about my various technical interests and today I thought I would do something a little bit experimentary and that is using my uh, go-to desktop microphone, the Audio-Technica AT2020, but using it in a handheld fashion. So the AT2020, like most condenser microphones, is more typically put up on something like a microphone mount, which is usually what I have going uh, when I'm recording my video vlogs with it. But there, I think there's, I've done a few videos recently regarding the correct way to address microphones. And I've tried to emphasize that speaking into a microphone in the correct address mode makes a massive, massive difference to pick up. Um, I explained in a previous video that the Audio-Technica AT2020, which is really one of those classic microphones, is a side address microphone, which means that you're supposed to speak into the side, but there is a right side and a wrong side. I'm speaking right now to the correct side, which you can tell by the Audio-Technica uh, uh, logo. And if I go 180 degrees off axis, you're going to get very degraded audio quality. 90 degrees off axis, off axis a bit worse and uh, going back to the correct type of address better. I can also do a proximity effect and I can also speak a little bit away from the microphone. Uh, so I haven't really played around with doing using a condenser microphone handheld yet. The concern would be traditionally with handling noise but I'm just kind of practicing moving up between my hands and it's really really not too bad. So uh, as the way you address your microphone makes such a big difference, I would like to suggest that uh, going handheld with your microphone, if you don't need to be on camera, whether you're doing a podcast or a voiceover recording or what have you, could actually be a very, very good way to really, really learn the nuances of your microphone. And when you're dealing with condenser microphones opposed to dynamic microphones, a lot of it is real nuance because these microphones are great at picking up details and uh, I think you'll find that even very small differences in how close you are to the microphone or how far away you are will make a significant difference in the uh, audio product you end up with. So uh, that's it for today. This is Daniel Rosal on Daniel's Tech World and if you have a condenser microphone, try plucking it out from whatever you usually have it mounted to and see how that goes. Thank you guys for watching. For more videos about technological things, do consider subscribing.